Good morning guys and welcome back to another vlog. Luca and I are just getting started for the day. It's 9.36 and we're going to make some breakfast. Um, today is Sunday and Brandon is doing a yard job today um, but he will be home around like noon and we're going to have a fun day. I think we're going to set up our Christmas decorations today. Luca and I are about to make breakfast so I just have this random idea to make like homemade um, hash browns. I've never made these before. So I'm gonna see how they turn out. And what I mean like homemade hash browns, I mean like the shredded kind. I've made like diced potatoes before. Can you say hi? Say hi to the camera. Hi. guys breakfast is ready the hash browns look good i haven't tasted them yet but um luke is digging in and this is what my plate looks like uh we're gonna eat and we will catch you guys later what's up guys it is much much later in the day i don't even know what time it is i think it's like five o'clock almost five o'clock luca had a nap earlier like we all had a nap <laughs> um but i definitely wanted to get this done tonight so we pulled out all of our christmas decor from the attic Gonna look it over and see what we got, and then Brandon will be home any minute. He had to run an errand. I'm looking a mess. All right, guys, we just pulled out um, all of our Christmas stuff. So we're just waiting for Brandon to get home, and then we will start setting stuff up. You got lights? I like them. They're cool. Yeah. He's got chocolate all over his face. I might have let him have I, I chocolate cake guess. before dinner. So I also have these like little fairy lights that I think I'm gonna try to put on this wreath.
what is up guys it is now the next day um we never finished the part from yesterday of us decorating we took a break but i still have a few areas i need to decorate i'm gonna do that today but um right now it is the morning and we just had breakfast we always eat a late breakfast because it's 10 13 and we're gonna get groceries today but i was just about to do my makeup just made my bed but I went to Ulta the other day and I got this new mascara combo to try out. So I thought I would do that on camera. And if it turns out good, I'll let you guys know. It's super cheap and you should try it if it turns out good. If you are in need of some Shape Tape concealer from Tarte, um, go to Ulta right now because you get a free little mascara with it. Um, and it's the same exact price as it would be just to buy the Shape Tape. So that was really cool to see. And they have a lot of other um, packages and deals. Right now, I guess for Black Friday. But this is the mascara that I wanted to try out. It's the Essence Lash Princess um, False Lash Effect. And it's $5, but it was actually on sale for like $3.50, I think, at Ulta right now. Um, and everybody says that this is a really, really good mascara. And since they were on sale, I went ahead and got the lash primer that Essence has. I've never tried a lash primer before, so I'm excited to try these together. Okay, so I just finished my makeup, except for the mascara. So I'm going to curl my lashes and then try out that mascara. I smelled it because it said something about has mango butter in it. <laughs> Yeah, so it looks like I have white eyelashes. Okay, so I did like two coats um, on my top lashes, and this is what they look like. Yeah, I think I think I really like it. Definitely worth the five dollars that it is. But right now, if you go to Ulta, it's on sale for three forty nine or three fifty. All right, we're gonna get ready to go to Lidl to get some groceries, and then we'll come back. I'll give Luca a nap and hopefully get some more Christmas um, decor set up. And a little out of breath, but we're all ready to go. Um, I just wanna show my outfit real quick. It's like, you know, just comfy. But the main reason I wanted to show you is because these are $15 Walmart shoes, and they're like the fake Vans. Um, Luca has on like the real deal, but his are high tops. Um, but yeah, I love these and they're memory foam and they're super cute and we're only $14. <laughs> um, I'm wearing my maternity leggings. These are the Zella leggings that I splurged on because I was having trouble finding leggings that were comfortable. So I really like these. My top is from Target. It's just a t-shirt. And then my sweater is from American Eagle a few years ago. And we are ready to go. Okay, I just got home and Luca fell asleep in the car. Don't mind this letter behind me. Um, he fell asleep in the car, so I moved him to my bed and he's taking a nap. I did get Starbucks. I should have got um, a ground egg because I'm like sucking this down. It's so good. I love the caramel brulee latte. I'm gonna put away these groceries and then we'll see what else I can get accomplished today. Okay, so I'm back. I wanted to show you guys what I'm gonna be doing for dinner tonight. I have to work tonight um, at my serving job, so I'm gonna make dinner in the crock pot for Luca and Brandon. So this recipe is super easy and it's only four ingredients. It's chicken and stuffing in the crock pot and it might sound like kind of boring, but it's actually really full of flavor and super good and it's really good to have around the holidays because it just reminds you of holiday cooking because it's like stuffing. Um, it's really good. I pulled out my crock pot. I have this like little one that we got as a wedding gift. I'm going to put one of those crock pot liners in it just to save up um, time for cleaning. These things are awesome if you use your crock pot a lot because you don't have to, you don't have to sit there and scrub your pot forever if stuff gets stuck on it. I got them from Lidl. But I think they just sell them at any grocery store. It's a little big for my crock pot because I have a small one, but it still works. 
So all you need for this recipe is um, chicken. You can use chicken breast, chicken tenderloins, whatever. Um, I'm using two chicken breasts, a box of stuffing, chicken broth, and cream of chicken soup. So what you have to do first is get a bowl and dump your stuffing mix in along with two cups of chicken broth and this will just like soak up into the stuffing and make it um, you know like fluffy and not hard anymore and you're gonna let that sit for probably about five minutes in the bowl until it soaks up all the liquid. So you can just set that aside. Next I'm just gonna spray the bottom of my crock pot. I'm going to add in my chicken and then this is optional. It has a lot of flavor if you don't do this either way, but I'm just going to put some poultry seasoning on my chicken. And then you're going to add in a cream of chicken soup right on top of the chicken. You can spread it around a little more evenly if you'd like. And you're just going to add the whole thing of stuffing on top of what's in the pot. And that is all you have to do for this recipe, guys. You're going to put the lid on it and plug it in and set it on low for 46 hours or high for four to six depending on if your chicken is frozen or not. And Brandon it usually like pulls out the chicken and he'll shred up pieces and then put it back in the pot and mix it all up and it's super good. He always says he wants cranberry sauce with it but I'm not a cranberry sauce person so I don't do that. But right now I'm just gonna do the dishes and then relax a little bit and probably put up some of this Christmas decor. We'll see. Okay, I somewhat cleared my counters and I put this little tree um, and this candle, little sign. Not too much going on, but very simple. And then I have these two little Christmas towels. I'm pretty tired though, so I'm going to have to wait on that shelf because I need to relax a little bit. Especially because I have to work tonight. So Lucas is still napping. I'm going to relax while I can. Mm -hmm. 